Hey everybody, what's good? Alright, so if you guys follow me on stupid Instagram, I posted something. I just thought I'd do something fun, something different, you know. And some of these questions are still updating, but I gave you guys a couple hours. But it was my fault because... I posted it at a wrong time. You big dummy. And I kind of wanted to wait all day and half of you fudgers are asleep. So anyways, I'll give you what I got. And let me know if you like this little, you know, interaction. Because you know what? I wanted to make a video where, like, when I hit 100 subs, I was going to do something. But it's not entirely possible at the moment. So, so anyways, let's get started right here. So the first question I got question from i'm just gonna expose who he is it's vader says why are you running first of all fuck face i'm kidding hey vader don't get mad i love you the great dragon i mocks this run from anybody nobody i don't run from nothing i don't run from anything so next time vader kick your little ass if you tell me i'm running away from something i don't run from shit I'm powerful. You have no idea how powerful I am. This one is from hmm, the wonderful Shadow Girl. Yeah, I'm exposing USG. Her question is, when are you going to get me my Mountain Dew and Doritos, you dummy? First of all, dummy, I ain't your man to be going around buying you Doritos and buying you Mountain Dew. If you want some of that stuff, better give me some kisses and some tongue action. <laughs> That's disgusting. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Um, I'll get you some of that stuff someday. Someday, SG. Someday. Maybe if you be a good best friend, I will. Oh, and in case you're wondering, folks, I'm in my home in Skyrim. As you can see, the girls back there, lightning over there is. <laughs> yeah. Why is lightning asleep in her? Uh, why is lightning asleep in her tea, you ask? Well, uh, I like her when she wears her armor. The other two back there, they're waiting their turn, but I told them this video is important. Keep your bitches on check. Keep your waifus on check. You got to learn to keep your hoes in check. This question is, well, I'm not going to name who she is, but she's a sweetheart, cool girl. I had a gameplay with her one time. She was pretty cool. I don't even know if she knew she was on the gameplay. She probably didn't even know. All right. Her question is, why don't you have a GF? You're hecka nice to everybody. Or to everyone. Oh, well. Because you're gay? <laughs> oh, oh, savage! I think personally it's because, um... It's just... It's like... I want to say you can't keep up with me. That's probably why. They can't keep up with me. I'm a, I'm a different type of dude. You know, I'm all about the honesty. I'm all about respect. I'm all about do whatever you want to do. Just be loyal to me. You know what I mean? And I think loyalty these days, it's not... It's like a fairy tale, right? Loyalty is a fairy tale, you know? No one believes in it anymore. Everybody has those, like, uh... They have those those boundaries where... They're like, this is who I am, accept it, you know what I mean? Then, when you, when you date an asshole who has that attitude where... This is who I am, this is what I do, accept it or leave. It, it's kind of like... You know, grow up a little bit, you know? Like, there's no need to... Be an asshole about that shit, you know? Like, the whole point about... I think relationships these days are not like how they used to be, you know? I think people expect other people to, you know, settle for what it is. I don't know. It's, it's kind of hard. It's a complicated answer, and I don't really want to make this video too long. But I guess the real reason why I don't have one is because no one likes me. Nobody likes a chubby, stinky dragon. Ah, uh, savage. This question says... Why do people say no homo? Well, because no homo, dude. I just don't want to sound gay. You know, I can understand why they would... I mean, I get where he's coming from. Because these days you hear it a lot. Like, for example, I, I mean, I'm, I'm cool with a lot of, like, uh... I'm cool with a lot of dudes that are... You know, I'm cool with a lot of new people I met online, right? And what's, uh... They compliment me on videos. They compliment me on, like, you know, this, the outfit I wear every day, which is, by the way, different. It's not the same shirt. Sometimes it is, but no. I got, like, five, ten of the same shirts, five, ten of the same pants, 
I just like this one outfit, right? But, you know, I get one person who says, oh, you look great, man. No homo, no homo, no homo. I mean, just, there's nothing wrong with complimenting somebody who, who tried to look good, you know? I mean, I guess the reason why they say no homo is because they don't, they want to express how nice you look and how, you know, they just want to express how nice you look without sounding like they're hitting on you. And I think that's why they say, you know, homo too much for everything. And you know what? Masculinity. Masculinity is a fucking... It's a fucking disease. Like, you know, you have to... Masculinity is a disease. Like, it's an infection. It gets into everybody and it makes them act certain ways. Like, oh, you're gay if you're if you're lovey-dovey with your girl. Or, or you're gay... You know what I mean? Like, if you're gay doing things normally, like, Prince Charming status, that's gay. It's not gay, but that's how they see it. It's gay. Like, masculinity is, you know, the pimp, you know? Slapping bitches and shit like that, you know? And it's not, you know? So that's why I think no homo comes from that. This question, do the Nazis have a UFO? I'm going to tell you this right now. When I arrived on Earth... I arrived on Earth during the dinosaur ages, and I know what killed it, but I can't tell you what killed it. Maybe later. The Nazis, they do have a UFO. They No, they did have a UFO. How do I know this? Well, because I've seen glimpses of it. It was on wheels. The fucking thing was on wheels. It was an actual flying saucer, but it was on wheels, and it was supposed to be a tank. Because, you know, Germany, they had tanks, and they had one of the top notches. Like, come on, Hitler had a time machine. Well... It didn't work. But come on, think about it. They were in Antarctica. What were they doing over there? There's nothing out there. Although there is something out there. I don't know what it is, but I know something's out there. And also, yeah, Hitler had a time machine. Didn't work, but he had top-notch scientists working on it. Of course they had a UFO. I'm pretty sure they did. They were about to rise to power. Be the biggest motherfuckers ever. Look at America now. Now America's got UFOs. This isn't a question, I just thought it was cute. I love you, Moxie. Yeah, I'm telling your boyfriend. What do you like most about a girl? Well, there's a lot of things, really. Most things I look for is understanding, honesty, loyalty. Those are the main things I look for. I don't care about anything. But if I had to name a couple features, I love the way their hair looks. I wasn't a fan of short hair until I met. You know, oh, you guys don't know her. Until I met. Walk in my video. Anyways, until I met um. Until I met Emma and I met SG, I didn't really like short hair. Emma, Emma's hair was really short. It was to a point where, well, I don't want to clown her. So I mean, I'm not, I, it's not clowning. It's just I did I didn't like it at first because. I wasn't used to the whole short hair thing, but I fell in love with it. I saw the cute side of it. I was like, hmm. And every time I saw her hair, I just wanted to yank it in. Sorry. And yeah, I like the way they laugh, the way they look at you, the way they act stupid. You can tell when girls act stupid when they're around somebody they like. They try to, you can, ju you can just tell, you tell. This isn't a question, it's more of a statement, you dick. It says, you look hot in the dark. Yeah, thanks for making me feel ugly, you crazy skank. I don't like dark. Well, I mean, I do, but in those moments, I don't want to be in the dark. I want to see your face, bitch. How powerful are you? It really depends. It really depends because, you know, the way that power works is... Depends on how evil that person is. Depends how evil it is, because it, it will. I will match it at some point. I will match it, right? And when I match it, it turns into who's got the most skill and who's got the most luck. Now, when it comes to like a dog or a hamster or a freaking mouse, yeah, when it comes to like a dog or a hamster or a mouse, now nah, I'll lose that fight. So. Or like the chicken, for example, like the chicken in a in the Legend of Zelda. If you hit one of those chickens, it kills you instantly. That that is a. <laughs> that 
That is a perfect example of, of uh, yeah, my strength. Yeah. That's all I got. It's already past uh, midnight. Those, the oh, the answer oh. key is already gone. But uh, I, yeah, I know a couple of friends. Have, yeah, if you dig this, uh, let me know. Let me know. It won the poll when I posted it on Instagram. It won that poll. So uh, it won the poll. Like it, it, it was only one no, and the person who said no, I, I kind of thought to myself. Nah, it's a yes. You just don't want to say yes because you don't want me to know that I you want that too, you little jerk. So fuck off. Anywho, I will see you guys later. Let me know if you guys like this kind of video. I'll do more. I'll make it more entertaining. I just couldn't do it because I wanted to hurry up and get this out. So it was rushed. And I fucked up because you know what Nintendo says. Don't rush anything or else it sucks. <sighs> Thanks for hanging out. See ya.